Hi, this is Lee Savage, Nigel Savage, and Angela Savage signing in for Ocean LED TV. We're here at the 2008 Key West Poker Run uh, in November 6th or 7th. We're not quite drunk enough yet, so we'll probably work out the dates in a bit. See you later. Now this is as good as it gets right here in Key West. Now, I'll tell you what, to have the Poker Run village here, Chris has got some stuff to hand out for you. Okay. I think I want Danielle to come out now. <laughs> oh, Danielle! Long time no see. Are you still working at that club? I am. Big in sports bar. Big in sports bar? And occasionally teasers. Teasers? Oh. Um, like, behind the bar? Or? Yeah. Hi. It's day two, which is a Saturday of the poker run. Um, Zach made me drink so much alcohol last night that I can't actually feel my legs. Um, which isn't good. However, we're here at Fort Zachary Taylor with the power performance boats, which we're starting to realize is quite a, which has quite a following. Um, so let's go look at some boats. So you've got all the teams lined up along uh, along the side of the road, um, each showing the boats. They've got the engineers there, the service technicians and stuff. And just one by one, they're going in the water. In the background, you can hear some of the boats running offshore. Um, the real difference uh, Zach and I are finding, well, seeing at this this poker run, is. The scale of it. Serious. Yeah, this is serious fun. That's a boat and a half. That really is a nice boat. And again. Oh, look, he's even got covers for his propellers. <laughs> and look at that. No lights. You've got plenty of room to put 12, A12s all around the back and all over the top. So at night or in the early morning or even in the daytime, do think if you get enough quantity of lights in a tight area, you're going to see a race flame. That's what it could be, a race flame. Hi, right, we're down at the docks uh, at Key West again. This time there's a few more uh, fast boats, uh, performance boats here. We've got a fountain, um, which I believe it has 20 tens. They're actually white lights, but they're the, because our white is so crystal clear, it's at 10,000 degrees Kelvin, they come up very, very, it shows the water in its true light. Fountain are now fitting these lights as as a fa at the factory, and then you have a Nortec with the blue. Now the water here, because we're in harbour, is slightly murky, so the blue's starting to get a bit milked. Um, but it looks fantastic. Here we have a a new cigarette boat. I'm not quite sure of the length. It's something beautiful blue boat. And then down here around the back, we have our brand new A12 LED lights, which, to be honest, point the camera at them. Point the camera at the boat, not at me. <laughs> Look fantastic. They're lighting up the entire party area. And combined with the, uh, the A3s in the engine compartment, it all just really just ties in. Uh, well, this is um, Bud Light, which apparently is now for sale. Um, in the engine base, this is a, a cat um, with an enclosed uh, cockpit, and it's tight in there. It's a that is a true racing machine, but it's quite cool. Some of the custom features you've got a beer keg as the uh, as the gear bot, as the gear levers, and then cans as the gear shifts in the engine bay here. Um, they've masked the uh, the uh, the batteries as six packs. <laughs> Very cool. Over this way we have the King of Clubs, which is obviously our boat. Um, so you have Stu's updated the poster with Ocean LED. And then you have the lights on the back of the boat. <coughs> now this is a very good demonstration actually of the lights turning themselves on and off. Um, you've got well, three lights on here. The two outer ones are on at the moment. The one in the middle, if you just get a 
you can see that is only slightly on that's because the lights got so hot because it's out of water um, and when, when I say so hot it's only like I, think, I believe the cutoff is about 65 70 degrees centigrade which if my methodology is right that's about 130 140 degrees Fahrenheit there's a thermal chip inside the light which turns it off so it doesn't damage the any part of the LEDs but even still I mean that temperature I can still touch it just and I haven't lost any skin which is pretty good um, so that's a very cool safety feature, which is why uh, our lights are the only ones really you can use in the rooster flame. The idea of uh, a poker run is that you get delta hand, a poker hand, uh, on the way down. You can also purchase uh, a poker hand whilst you're here. So the top decks get displayed in the trailers. Obviously, the uh, lovely girls are helping. Um, originally, they have donated um, three A6s in the special ed edition uh, A Flame Reds uh, for the top prize. Stu Jones, he's got to run. I got, I got to run, but. I'll be right back. <laughs> Is it underneath or anything? Probably. <laughs> you got yours in your purse? Well, you know, we... Can I see that straw? Oh my God, it's a penis. And it's erect. It's a little small. Oh, yes. But it does the job, apparently. It's not the size, it's what... <laughs> Never mind. Look at those ocean LEDs on my boat, man. Those things are bad ass. We went for a ride the other day in the blue light shooting out on the rooster tail. Driving around at night. Like a bunch of wild men. <laughs> at night in a power boat. Uh, it's after we had a few drinks first, of course. No, we didn't. We didn't really do that. Not, they've got them on cigarette, they've got them on Nortec, they've got them on yachts, they've got them on power boats all over the place. The Ocean LED product is something you need to put on your boat. If you want to pimp out your boat, that's what you do around here. That's how we roll. Ocean LED, thank you, gang, for being here. Okay, so we're here at the uh, Florida Power Boat Club hideout uh, in Key West at the Hyatt Regency, um, which is possibly one of the best spots to actually watch the race. Um, I don't know what really to tell you. It's, uh, <laughs> it really is quite something to behold. Um, we're now in the third race uh, for today, and we've got the these are now the the fast ones. So they're just about to get started. January. Uh, we're thinking this is going to be more of a permanent thing for us in the future. Uh, Key West was fantastic, the races were amazing, and uh, Duval Street was messy. messy. <laughs> See you next time.